Hello, this is Ace Man, and we are not playing anything right now. <laughs> no, this is a tutorial. Um, as I said in one of my recent videos, uh, I know how to fix the lag issue in Gothic 3, or at least one of the uh, workarounds you could do to fix the lag, because it is quite uh, a big issue. It's very annoying. Um, but what you can do is you can change the font. And I'm not kidding here. This actually uh, this actually removes pretty much all the lag. What you have to do is go into um, the folder where your Gothic 3 game is located. Uh, in my case, programs, so on. Uh, this is on Danish though, but still. And then you uh, you locate the true type uh, font thingy here, which is called just called Gothic 3. Now you want to rename that. I already did that. I just renamed it to deleted um, the actual file. Uh, or you might be able to delete it, but I uh, I'd say just rename it. That's the best idea. Um, and then you uh, go into your Windows folder. Let's see if we can find that. It's here, and you will find the fonts here. Um, and you can just choose whatever font you want. I choose Arial because that seems to work uh, best. And then just uh, take the normal Arial and uh, copy it, and then put it in here in your uh, Gothic 3 folder thingy, and rename it Gothic 3. Um, don't rename it TTF at the end, just Gothic 3. That should work. Um, remember first to have uh, renamed the old file to uh, whatever deleted in my case, but what just whatever. Um, and that should pretty much fix the lag. It might sound really silly that <laughs> that fixes lag, but it does. So um, try it out. I hope this helped. Uh, if you have any questions, please do uh, comment. And I knew, do know that this is probably on YouTube already, but I wanted to show it you to you myself because this it is quite a simple uh, thing. There might be uh, other issues you have, but that doesn't uh, necessarily mean that it it wouldn't help doing this. That's all I'm saying. So thank you for watching, goodbye for now.